Hey, it's Zoe, and today I'm going to be doing a nail tutorial for you guys, and I'm going to be doing it on Zara. Hi! Alright, so I'm going to be doing a cute little purple owl, and here's the colors I'm going to be using. So this is Confetti Belle de Bull. It's a pretty light purple. Um, Sally Hansen Hardest Nails Mellow Yellow. Um, and this is Kiss Nail Art Paint and Pearl Blue. Wet and Wild Wild Shine Black Cream. And a white striker. I have both. All right, let's get started. Oh, and I also forgot I'm going to be using base coat and top coat. This is Seche Seche. How do you pronounce that? Whatever, Seche Clear and OPI top coat. Okay, so you'll want to start out with clean nails, no nail polish at all. And then you're going to put on a base coat. I'm using the Seche Clear. So just put that on. And then let it dry. Do this to all your nails. Next we're going to be using your base color. I'm using the Belle of the Ball. It's a light color light purple, but really you can use any color. Alright, so just paint that on your whole nail. And I'm going to finish up doing that on all of her nails. Okay, so next we're going to be doing the beak of the owl, since it's going to be like a little owl. So. We're going to be using a yellow nail polish. This is the Sally Hansen Mellow Yellow. And you're also going to need a dotting tool, but if you don't have one, a toothpick works fine. So I got this dotting tool at Sally Beauty Supply. And, but you're also going to need a plastic bag. This is just to put on the nail to put the nail polish on so you can like dip your dotting tool or a toothpick into it. So put a little bit of the yellow nail polish on the plastic bag and then dip your dotting tool into it and then make a little beak on the nail about halfway down or a little above halfway. Just like that. And now you are going to do this to all your nails. All right. Five. Okay, so next we're going to be using a black and making the eyes. So you would need to use a larger dotting tool for this, but I don't have a larger dotting tool. So you can either use like a large, pen like we're sewing or something you can't really see it a large sewing pen not really a sewing pen that's what they are or whatever or the back of a makeup brush or a paint brush which is what i'm going to be using so take your black and put a dot of it onto your plastic bag whoops I spilled that everywhere. Oh well. And you're going to be dipping the back of the, 
or whatever you're using to make the dots into the black and then making a dot on the nail and just make two big dots for eyes and then do that to the rest of the nails. Okay, so now that you've done all the black parts of the eyes, we're going to add little white dots and eyes as like a little shine or glisten or something like that. Like so, little pupils. Yeah. So I'm using this white striper. If you don't have a white striper, you could just use white and a dotting tool or toothpick. So just add a little bit of white. Just like that. And then do that to the rest of your nails. Okay, so now we're going to add wings and feathers. You can use whatever color you want for this. Like you could use a darker version of the background color or just the color that you think looks pretty with it. Like for example, I'm using dark blue. And I'm using a striper, which is probably easiest. But if you don't have a striper, again, you can use a dotting tool or a toothpick. All right. So here's what you're going to do. So you add a little curved line on the edge. And then fill it in. And then do the same on the other side. Then add just a few little horizontal marks. For feathers. And there. So do that to the rest of your fingers. And you're almost done. Okay, so now the only step left is to put on a top coat. So just oops, put that on over your owl. Make sure that it is dry before you do that or else your owl will smudge everywhere and not look like an owl. It'll look weird. So it's a it'll look like a deformed owl. Yeah. So do that to all your nails and then you are done. And these are really easy, fun, and they're also really pretty. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. If if you try this out, somehow like link the picture in the comments or leave a video response or something. Just I'd like to see them. Thank so, you.